Hello everyone, my name is Mitro and welcome back to XCOM 2. So, we are still uh, working on a lot of things. Uh, actually, a lot of things will be ready very soon. Like these and uh, a lot of our guys will be back in action in a couple days as well. Uh, I guess we can check it. I actually spent quite a while here wondering about things uh, before starting the episode. So yeah. You can see we have uh, plenty of guys coming in uh, just one or two days. Which is good because we kind of need them. But uh, yeah, it, it's actually looking fairly okay right now. Mm. I should get the uh, Ellerim research well done. Underway, there are some researches I'm gonna... I think this will expire. I don't actually know. How this uh, this works, but uh, we don't really need Intel right now, so it's a moot point anyway. So yeah, there's some inter interesting, uh, uh, interesting research like the lost autopsy. I kind of want to know what's, what that even does. Uh, priest uh, purifier, and then we have, uh, of course, all the standard guys. We haven't seen that many chrysalids. That's actually funny. We've seen a I'm lot of berserkers this time. We've made so far, but there's still so much more to learn about the aliens' motivations. But uh, yeah, I think we will just go on. Mm. No retrainings, huh? <laughs> okay, I was uh, I was in the wrong window. I thought I was in the one of the. Where is that even? Right here. The, um, remove negative trace menu. But yeah, actually, let's take the combat tactics. These are kind of one class tactics only, so I guess something like a like biggest booms is kind of nice. I mean, they're definitely good, but uh, not really worth the money right now. I would say. Because we're still in the surviving mode, and I think we need to get uh, get the Elerium done to get the next next level of uh, weapons and armor and stuff. But yeah, we had the four dark events going on, so let's see what what's happening in the map. Mm, uh, don't really need alloys either. The elders know all too well that you approach the refuge of the insidious Templars. Do not assume that their aid will make any difference to your cause. I think I should actually probably do this contact uh, after the supplies. Uh, I can already go here because of the facility lead. Wow, that's weird. It seems on the other side. Uh, but. Uh, but this bonus it might actually be nice to get that double double effect of uh, or, or it's not double effect but uh, increased effect on weapon mod that that's nice and uh, yeah let's let's Avengers finish off the supplies first though. It, it's still very touch and go because I don't want to release the next uh, ruler before I kill the previous one. But uh, if I'm gonna go here, I will release uh, him, so there will be rulers everywhere. Which is uh, not really what I'm looking for. Oh my god. We got the plasma grenades, finally. The Congress here grenade uh, augmented by alien energy pulse tech. The plasma grenade does more damage than the standard frag grenade and is more effective. I don't know why I'm reading this. Advanced explosives. You know, I remember this skill, but I do don't remember what the heck does it do or uh, the project. I think it did something very stupid, <laughs> like uh, I don't know. But I, I I seem to remember it had nothing to do with explosives, so it it was not, well I don't know. We'll find out if we need to. I think I will save my cores for now. I think I'm uh, I'm set with the stuff we have. Or happy. Uh, or should I do something like grenade? 
thing with the experimental grenades is that uh, I don't really like using them. I, I really don't. I just want that uh, cover remover, standard frag grenades, and that's it. So <laughs> it's very rare that I actually use any of these experimental grenades. I tried. Uh, I've tried several times uh, to use them, but. Uh, it always goes into a situation where I would need that uh, standard grenade and uh, I have some crap grenade which doesn't do... Uh, or which doesn't remove cover, so... So yeah, that's uh, that's my reasoning not to go there. So I could actually remove uh, this Kremlin, but there's actually nowhere to put it. These are all Kremlins, right? Because this building is actually kind of wrong building right now. Yeah, if the resistance ring was there, I would certainly put the Kremlin there as well. So yeah, that will be based. Mm. Guess that's uh, kind of feels bad uh, to not have anything going on here, but uh, I don't really need these. I would much rather have the next level upgrades at uh, sooner, sooner time. Uh, I guess the time uh, time has really passed for the sparks uh, to be useful at this stage. I heard that they actually improved them. Uh, they are actually better at shooting right now. Uh, it's probably not that big of an improvement, but uh, I felt like that was the worst thing about sparks. They were very poor at shooting, so it's uh, it's it's probably making them a very very more uh, or a lot more useful. Uh, but yeah. Because they will be squaddy level, if I make them. And right now the squaddy level doesn't feel like a uh, thing we need. But uh, enough of that. I'm, I'm randomly rambling, it's early in the morning and, you know. Got an urgent communication coming in for you now, Commander. I had high hopes for the resistance under your leadership, Commander. And you have outdone yourself. Hey, finally something positive. Oh crap. No, empowered me. I am stronger than ever. Prelate. I will not fail them. Can summon Advent Priests. All has been revealed. I hope you prepare a warm welcome for my arrival. Oh great, an additional dark event. That's what we need. Retribution. Yeah. Attempt to sabotage, okay. Mm, we do have intel, so let's actually check this. Uh, okay, it's not that, uh, it's not good, but it's not that bad. Uh, this is kind of weird. The stun lancers have a chance to move after performing a melee attack. I don't, I don't know how I feel about this. Viper runes is always annoying. It's a it's it's very annoying, but uh, usually you can deal with the advanced soldiers. So right, still can't remove the resistance rising. So that's a really annoying. I would much rather have it than the lightning strike, for for example. This power card might actually be very useful at some point. I should uh, I should increase the influence. Of this card. I, I mean, this will recover. That would uh, basically. I think it will uh, make them less tired. I don't actually know if that affects the tired counter at all. It might be just a will. Uh, which uh, regenerates kind of slowly. So we got 82 supplies, huh? Just double checking here. Yeah, it's it's looking very good. Uh, Chilong will be of course out forever because he got pretty badly beaten. Because for whatever reason everyone hates Grenadiers apparently. Or at least everyone in the advanced side. Mm. I guess the improved pull ups pull pops will be ready soon as well. Uh, 
I guess I can grab the supplies. Avenger plotting new course. We might be able to build something with the new supplies then. This will prove to have been an important breakthrough. Well, that didn't take you. Okay. Oh, this is this is too good. I mean, I'm sure it didn't remove the, that much from the time, but uh, I will begin our research immediately. For once, we got exactly what I what I actually wanted. So that's that's very cool. Okay. The question is, do I wanna do a building or? We don't have power Maximum to actually power build anything. And uh, if we build the power relay, we won't have money to build the shadow chamber. Anyways, besides, I think I will build the shadow chamber here. I think that makes a lot of sense. At least I have the third engineer to be t put here. 27 days is a long, long time, but I guess we have to live with that. That being said, not much else. Um, I was just looking at the poster. Hello, Commander. Um, yeah, we pretty much have everything we need. We could do the mimic beacon. I think this could have saved a couple of my guys, so I should definitely bring it. I'm just trying to remember what were the nerves to this item. I think it's one of the nerves was the actually the price. And uh, I think they didn't have a 100% chance of attacking it anymore. And they have 100% chance of hitting it if they do. Except that it seems to be bucking and they miss sometimes. Right, we have the refraction field as well. I should probably do this. No, 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 not the mind shield. Uh, the mimic people. Although the mind shield wouldn't be that bad either. But I guess I will wait for I'd the like next to get mission. A better look at that rifle the chosen hunter oh. uses. Oh, sorry, I interrupted you there. Kind of auto piloted with the clicks. I think I will do this contact though. It should be. It should be solid. Oh, it requires. Shitload of intel because we don't have the tower. Well, this is where our surplus will go. Then. For the Brazilian corridor. It's a shame, but you eventually have to build this. There were some casualties during that last oh. covert action, Commander. Casualties. But our troops will all recover after some well-earned rest. I mean, if there were casualties, that would be pretty bad. So it looks like Chad got, got a wounded there, but uh, Simpson is fine, and that's uh, I feel that's the more important part. So we have to unlock the chosen stronghold mission. We finally got our access point to the stronghold. Once we move in, there won't be any place left for Jack Smite to throughout the run. This is our chance to end their hunt for good. It will be a great feast. Hmm. We just got some new intel on the Chosen. It should be easier to hunt them down now. We have completed our hunt for the Jaxmite Sura. Our mission to strike at them in a inter stronghold is now available. If we want to take out the Chosen once and for all, we should move to strike their stronghold. The Resistance has found our access point. We just have to make use of it. Oh boy. Oh boy. We've got a shot at hitting the elders hard, something we haven't tried before. You up for it, Commander? Additional comm station construction. Now our network of finally additional traffic reducing the cost of additional comm station upgrade. Uh, 50%? Ha! Huh. I mean, I eventually have to do that. 
These require Sergeant Blast, but that's actually not that hard. Or these require Lieutenant, Lieutenant Blast. But if I'm gonna go for the mission, I should check that I have a good team. I will probably wait for the witch one day. Maybe I should wait for the Geelong as well. I've, I get the feeling that this mission might be hard. But, uh, I mean, we're ready to go pretty much. It's kind of shame that uh, he's actually our priority, or number one grenade. Not a priority grenade. Grenadier, I suppose. Uh, because the uh, rest of our grenadiers are kind of low. <laughs> May I haven't even made it sergeant yet, huh? But I think I can afford to sending a sergeant on a mission. We have a couple rangers ready to go, Minas and uh, and and uh, Vandal here. So I think I will send Bruce Lee and. Uh, and then one of these rookies, or lower level guys, on a covered action. What other things we had? I mean, uh, this would be just a reduction to the avatar progress. That's a, that's a pretty solid option. I'm just thinking... We do have the three star base to go for. How about this... Uh, Retribution, brutal crackdown of resistance, permanently lower XCOM's income. Mm, yeah, our income is kind of starting to get quite low. Super PCS engineer would be nice. Uh, these are actually pretty good. All uh, the combat intelligence, uh, I don't feel like that's so important. Or uh, it's a, it would be good, but uh, yeah, it's not that important right now. This uh, would be nice, because we haven't done the upgrade yet. Uh, this would be actually pretty nice. I think it would save something like 100 supplies. But then again, uh, I could uh, just grab one, the 100 supplies. Intel collection. Another facility lead. This facility probably wouldn't have the... the, the Hunter or the alien guy. So I mean that's uh, that would be actually kind of nice. God, there's so many nice options here. I feel like I will do this though. That would uh, that would allow me to put uh, one of the Templar cards in in game. This is a permanent reduction though, so... So, so... We don't get that much supplies right, uh, right now either. So this would be actually pretty bad. God damn, there's so many things that could, could go wrong. Ah, this is the problem. There's so many... So many good ones. So let's go for the counter, because uh, we won't be killing Warlock, and I... Uh, no, not the Warlock, this was the, the Sniper's one, I believe. Can I actually see them? Uh, nope. This one. I think we will be killing her. So yeah, the sabotage, uh, the retribution is actually Warlocks, so yeah. I guess it makes sense because I think the Templar missions are always uh, aimed toward the Warlock. They all have uh, four up strengths, I don't know if they will gain more, probably will. But I might uh, actually want to 
counter the retribution. We've constructed the ring facility, Commander, but currently yep. we don't have any soldiers deployed on covert actions with the resistance. Yeah, let's do this. We cannot change the card uh, for the uh, ring anyway until the next. Um, I believe it's once in a month, not every supply drop. But uh, yeah. Let's send uh, Siphon. Um, aim plus three, I'm sure. It's not the best for the. Well, I mean, plus three aim isn't really good for anyone. I guess I could uh, allocate this to avoid the capture. We might get a uh, ambush, though, so should I bring more leveled up guys? Yeah, that's a good point, though, huh? The ambushes haven't been that hard, but uh, I guess they might get uh, harder over time. Or uh, probably will. Ah, whatever. Let's send them. Understood, Commander. My followers will appreciate the support of your soldiers. I sure hope they do. Right, we actually have upgrades here as well. Oh, these would be nice. Uh, but the lack of power... Uh, yeah, I was seriously considering... I think I will get the upgrade after I've researched the Elerium to actually get more power. Yeah, I think... I think that was a thing, so... I'm gonna wait for that before I do anything stupid. Uh, let's finish off this relay. We'll get some of the dark events done as well. We're reading you. Okay. Mm. So what's the situation here? It's still a couple of days, three days to go. After Silong is head back, I think we will just head head off to the assassin. I don't know what kind of mission stores are, but I'm gonna assume they are hard. Hmm. I guess we can start working on this. Commander, we've utilized all of our available communications capacity. We can't establish any new contacts until we upgrade our systems. Yeah, that's be fine though. When inspired, our team is actually quite efficient. So yeah, we get the plasma rifle on board, armor research. And the Elerium con con do it. Okay. Shadow Chamber Construction. I could... I could do that. Fifty percent reduced cost. I think that would actually be great. I think it's something like two hundred supplies once again. I will make that our highest priority. Right now, supplies are kind of our problem. Our work is proceeding as expected, Commander. Of course, that doesn't actually help us with the <laughs> researches we need to do, but these are very long researches. Holy shit. I guess we are short on scientists or something. So it's, it's still gonna be a while until we get this. For sure, okay. The aliens have considerable resources at their disposal, but we've still managed to do reasonably well against them, despite our own limitations. So three, do three more days. I'm actually, I probably should check, uh, check the upgrade price. 150, huh. Damn. We could use some supplies. Things are starting to get very expensive. So we would we would get six more uh, power, but we won't uh, we wouldn't have money to build it. Uh, any of these upgrades. So it's kind of moot point to buy that right now. I do wonder what uh, other upgrades we might be able to do. These are all upgraded. Training center. Nope. 
TTS doesn't have upgrade. Uh, Proving Grounds doesn't have upgrade. Resistance comes upgrade, right? But we can actually just uh, put engineer here to get uh, get some extra contacts. Oh, that's uh, that's how I could have moved the card away from the. I've been stupid. I should have put an engineer here just before the mod changes. Yeah, there was absolutely not no reason why not to do that. Then I could have removed the resistance contact card and played it on other slot. Well, I didn't. I didn't think that true, huh? So we only have like couple upgrades we wanna do, but they are over 100 supplies each. And then we actually need to build a shadow chamber soon as well. This will give us a. Well, it won't give me a, give us supplies at all. So that's uh, <laughs> that's. That's not gonna help with supplies. Okay. This is a bit of strategy layer gameplay here. I don't know how interesting it is. Oh. God damn it. I wanted to do the assassin mission with our A team. Operation Starving Corpse. That's <laughs> that sounds nice. Oh, but we could get the engineer I wanted, huh? Scientist. Uh, that would be nice as well. Supplies. Oh man. God damn it. These are all good. Here we have a lost. Here we have a lost. Yeah. That's a uh, kind of bad as well. And here we have lost and locations code. We have advanced intel on the mission side and we'll be able to observe all enemy movements. I mean that will be huge. There's no question about that. But it's a protected device mission so from uh, our previous experience uh, they will just all be around the device anyway. So is there that much of an advance to advantage on uh, seeing them? I don't know. Uh, advent only extra armor is nasty. This can be very nasty. And this, uh, this is awful as well. Engineer versus scientist versus supplies. We need all of those things. I feel like the last engineer would be good right now. Or this would be the last uh, good engineer. But we gonna could use him or her right now. So maybe I will do this. Setting course for Western Europe. There should be a way to do all all three. Mm. Do I wanna save my A team for the next mission? Let's see. We have only one Reaper, so yes, I want to save her. Mystic is. Uh, so let's see. Definitely not taking uh, him. Slider. Sure. I think Tapper is our number one healer, although it's pretty much the same with the with Slider. And uh, Zilong is actually still hurt, apparently for zero days, so... Okay. Ooh, Mox. Is it Mox missing? Let's actually see. I think I will put Vandal on. Take mayo. We could use those new grenades. Question is, uh, do I wanna take Mox? Who would I send on the next mission? I would uh, probably take the sniper, Chilong, Menas, Witch. So that's four guys. Tapper for sure, and then probably Raven. So yeah, I can take Mox on this mission.
do wonder if I have better upgrades. Mm. Do I have an advanced expanse magazine? Should really make it. Items available, weapons available, and uh, armor available. Sure. Where's my EXO suite? Did I lose the EXO suite? Oh, I probably actually sent it on the on the on the mission there, huh? Yeah, it's uh, it's probably on the ranger I sent on the send on the mission, just like the axes and stuff like that. Ah, uh, that's actually not good. Especially since it's, uh, that mission has the chance to be an ambush, so... Well, I mean, I will probably find out if, if, if it was good or not. Slider is kinda set up... Uh, so this is the auto loader, this is expand magazine. How is this even... What? Shouldn't that weapon be upgraded? Oh, it was on the capture sky, right. That's kind of funny that it doesn't get upgraded. I don't know how... I can't upgrade it anymore, huh? That's... Uh, that's funny. Uh, I have the Villa BCS, but I definitely do not want to put it on Mayo. Is there anything better? We don't have the Afton's repeater. Maybe I actually want to put it on the rifle. I don't have anyone with the rifle anyway on this mission. What about the sniper? Yeah, it has the advanced, advanced magazine. I think I will put the magazine upgrade on Moxton. We don't have any stocks. That might be an um, issue. But I mean, we have the combat protocol, so maybe not. Yeah. We have the new grenades. It's again not that useful when they are lost. Should I actually consider bringing someone else than the grenadier? be fine, right? I'm, I'm gonna be a little bit sad of uh, not having a scout this this mission. Oh, but we have the advanced scouting. We don't need the scout. That's actually perfect. Yeah, let's hit it. Oh, what I was supposed to build. I was supposed to build something before a mission. Right, the Mimic Beacon. We're in the pipe. Five by five. Uh, let's build the Mimic Beacon. Okay, now it's saying it would be back. Commander. So here would go another hundred of supplies. Well, Tygen seems to have a habit of scratching that scar on the back of his head. I wonder if anyone made sure his chip was actually removed. I should actually check it. Well, this uh, the school mining is probably the best upgrade right now here. The shadow keeper is uh, kind of me. Hmm, it was this mission, right? So who would take the mimic beacon then? It's a slight problem when we have uh, this viper suit that. Uh, you don't have that many slots. Maybe I will just put it on Templar. Ah, but if you run into the ruler, I do want to have it there. 
frost grenade. I think I can put the frost grenade on a mayo too. And this is not the grenade slot, so yeah. Oh, he doesn't have the grenade skill anyway. Huh, that's uh. Well, we won't be using grenades that much with the with the lost. Hopefully, we won't actually use grenades at all. Okay, let's uh, let's just do it. I was thinking about changing the treasure rounds to Mayo because he's the lowest le lower level guy. In position for deployment. But it should be fine. I just hope that it wasn't a mistake of not taking a major here. Operative managed to rig up some sort of data interception device through an access point on the advent network running through here. The data is apparently critical to the aliens' latest operation, and they're already moving to destroy the device. We're heading in to make sure that doesn't happen. Take out any hostile targets nearby, secure the AO, and protect that device. Good old Operation Starving Corpse. Forces are already moving to destroy the data tap installed nearby. We need to lock down the area and secure uh, the device at all costs. I see the lost as well. This is so this is so good, actually. So what do we have? We have a mutants with the codex. We have priest with the stun lancer and a random guy. We have a lot of lost. actually okay so that's the whole map then uh, that feels like a little less enemies than I was expecting maybe it's because the lost are here there's only two squads of enemies what can't it can't that be even true I mean it's a small map and there's a lot of lost but I mean, only two groups of enemies is uh, It's kind of nice. Okay. Can the sniper just take take somebody off right away? I guess I still need to have vision uh, to use the squad side. I cannot cheat with this. Uh, well, cheat that much with this, and probably won't get the target previews either. But I bet I could get kill zone salts if I move my guy there and have the sniper in position. Oh, but we have the concealment, right? It should be very perfectly safe. Move. Moving on target location. Uh, you actually have a fear of chosen, huh? Got some hostiles grouped over here. Yeah, I forgot about the concealment there. Uh, I could just go. But uh, I feel like kill zoning here. Yeah, we should probably try to do it, do this right first. I'm on the move for the first time. Affirmative, moving out. As in order. The lost are a little bit scary right now because they have uh, so much uh, hit hit points. Yes. So I won't be doing the kill zone this turn, but heading there now. Might as well grab the cover then. Roger, I've got my eyes on. Not evade detection. Got it covered. I'll keep it under watch. Got it covered. Hopefully they don't move. 
Oh, they go for the lost. Well, I mean, that's perfectly fine for me. Yeah, that would actually be... That's actually perfect for me, if they take care of the lost. This must be happening because we see them all. I think it's kind of bugging out. Or not necessarily bugging out, but... I don't think this would be happening if I didn't have the sea trap. Professional bullet curving. What? Oh, bastard. Then damn it. And it's on fire. Oh, fuck's sake. Well, that went just... <laughs> just to hell. Can still do this though. Lockdown confirmed. Oh, do I wanna get there to reveal this shit? You actually have Phantom. Let's just do the hide and add this shot. The thing here uh, is that the guy in the back might actually run in. Do I wanna just overwatch or trap these guys? Uh, I could overwatch slider. Yeah. Nice on the prize. Yeah, let's leave everyone else available because they have multiple multiple actions they can take. Now oh, come on, man. Not They're on to us. Over here. Fuck, I for forgot about the return fire. Get kills on. We might lose this mission because the thing is on fire. That's never good. Priests just go down. Okay, it's on Uh It's actually funny that the stone lancer is actually on fire as well. But yeah, I think at least previously these things will just burn down, and that's that. Not much I can do about it. Um, how do I wanna actually deal with this? Can't really get a flank shot on this uh, this guy, but I could go for a pistol shot. Of course, Mox could could deal with the guy, but uh, I need somebody to all watch him. Maybe I'll just take the, out this, uh, this guy with the box. If he, if he can hit, of course. This lost might get activated, who knows. It's not a guaranteed kill. Justice would be. Might as well justice him. Do I have a stock? I don't have stock. I'm just thinking here about what I do with the uh, air intent. Probably just all watch for the for the Templar. I think I will get another kill zone shot on the this guy if he moves. Or when he moves. Yeah. Let's take the guaranteed kill. You are judged. It's just this time, boys. It is dead. I didn't just watch here. I will 
I think I can move here. If this guy moves close enough, he will reveal me, but then I will get the shotgun shot. On the move. So it's uh, it's not all bad. He's Eyes on the prize. Oh, he gets a move first. He will probably take the pistols at them. Or not. Oh. Gods elevate me. I didn't even think about this. This will complicate things. This uh, brutal I've heard is pretty crazy because it uh, reduces their will permanently. Prelate can summon Advent Priest. That's not fun. Immune to explosions. Yeah, regenerates lost health. At least we have one Templar. Takes increased damage from close range attacks. So yeah, that's a double increased damage for Templar. Regen regeneration is uh, crazy though. Strike you down. So last time he actually bugged out and we couldn't actually even fight him. So this will be the first time we actually see what he does. Shot wide. That must have been something like 90%. Oh, I get double shot on this. Jesus, guys, what the? Remember your training. Now he gets to stay smokes. Well, that's not actually that bad. It's just annoying. Another miss. Okay, this time. This time it actually hit. And he's still going for the device. These guys are just randomly walking around. You will make a fitting sacrifice for the elders. Oh right, this Dimitri. <laughs> I was wondering why how the sniper shots can be so bad. Ah, uh, you need a reload. I don't know why the holo targeting isn't triggering it anyway. Maybe it's uh, it doesn't work on all what sorts. Anymore. I might be able to get the pistols off if I grapple here. And I might be able to grapple here if I move Mayo away first. Mayo would actually. No, this is not the flanking shot, huh? These uh, lost are kinda annoying. Guess Mayo can't really really do that much. Why I don't trust this target preview at all? Oh, it's on this guy. <laughs> yeah. God damn it. I mean, he's, uh, he's just in the open. I would have loved to shred him so much. Guess I can still do it with me after. For whatever reason, he doesn't actually see him. From here. It's really, really strange. Mm, these guys. These guys will get to us for sure. I could just go poke that guy. These, uh, these guys would activate for sure. Uh, 
Hmm, this is not uh, this is not the best. I would, would love to move a Vandal away from here, so I could take a shredding shot with Mayo on this uh, this guy. But if I move a Vandal, I will get revealed, and even worse, I will probably get shot on. A I could, of course, just uh, do something like this. Thing is, I don't know how how far these guys see. These guys might screw us up pretty badly. But is the phantom uh, phantom really that important here anymore? Probably not. If this lost were here, I would uh, definitely go something like here and just take the shot. We have the combat protocol here. Um, she actually is, could have pretty good shots. Okay, let's uh, let's start with this. We will reveal here, but Finally. hopefully it's fine. I'm spotted. The elders have chosen me, just as they have chosen you, Commander. We are both. Destined to serve at their side, to bring their vision to this world and beyond. Come, allow yourself to be reclaimed. That's the Elder's Warlock. All reports indicate he's nearly as dangerous as they are when it comes to psionic capabilities. Yeah, and he really likes to talk way too much. Oh, I actually get a double chance with the lightning hands. Okay, I think I will take it. Enemy not, destroyed. That, not that I need it, because I'm a professional. So this is a squad side sword. I'm trying to find if there's a way to get a slider in a position to take a shot. Position like this, huh? Yeah, I mean that's pretty solid. I would love to shred this guy first though. I think that's a solid miss. Think about uh, who will kill that. <laughs> who will kill that? Stun launcher. Uh, I thought Mox would be back, but uh, apparently he's uh, he's not going to be back. Uh, ha. Love to try to take out both of them. I think this is pretty solid. I can then uh, reload here and uh, take a shot. But that puts a slider in a dangerous position for sure. Good to go. I mean, uh, this is one hundred percent shot, so I guess I will take that. I could just mimic vegan here, to be honest. It's not like uh, there's that many enemies. I don't know. I I don't think it works against him, but it would might it might work against the uh, the guide here. The rest of my options is not that great. Can't um, I could? I think this is a free action. Or was it an action? <laughs> I think I tested this last time, but I can't remember in the last episode. I never can remember these things. Uh, fuck it. Let's see. Oh, it missed anyway. Target's still up. 
Okay. Oh, that's some nice damage. Heavy armor. That guy has a lot of hit points, though. Yeah, let's go for it. I think I just mimic vegan here. Yeah, let's see what that does. I don't think it uh, it uh, works against the warlock, but uh, my intention is it that it works against that stun lancer. We might actually just get him with the pistol. So he regenerates three hit points, but uh, that's not actually that bad. And we got him, okay. Target eliminated. Okay, four damage is actually. Jesus, double priests. Oh, he goes up. Goes up. Uh. The crap was that? These guys have so much hit points. It's actually not even funny anymore. Oh, it was a different squad. Hopefully the advent will actually help us to take care of this and these guys. <laughs> They all just randomly came in and activated. Oh, it must have been the Mimic Beacon, actually. Soldier down. Get them back on their feet on the double. Uh, this would actually call for a grenade. What uh, uh, rent him? He's uh, out of range. Oh, he can climb uh, any wall. Huh? It's a nice ability. So we have a uh, two guys out. I think I can uh, Here, revive both you. both of them with. What just happened? Oh shit, he's just around here. I'm fairly certain it's a free action, so I can actually do it. They're in here. So he's just fine. These uh, shots uh, leave a lot to be desired. Uh, I can't, can't really go f all right because I don't have all my axes. Could run and gun for sure. I don't want to trigger these guys yet. Hopefully they don't kill the objective. Definitely want to run and gun here. Run and gun here I come. These priests uh, are kind of nasty. They can eliminate all of my squad. Ah! With the sustains and yeah, I, I mean the stasis. Not the sustain, of course. That was actually bad. I can crabble as well. 
is the new place to be. The party zone. Changing position. Don't have to God, these guys have so much hit points. I don't think there will be any robotic units in this mission anyway, so... What about you? What kind of shots oh, yeah. you have? This is a pretty solid shot. Yeah, let's, let's check this out. No stuns. That's a pretty solid shot. Uh, Mox doesn't really have a, that great of shots. Can the V-Plus actually kill this guy? Good. Good. But what do I do then? Could actually... Ah, uh, not... Not good enough. I could have grenaded the, the guy down there. Or down from there. Can take double shots. To grenade uh, this guy's cover. Nope. Still out of range. The sniper really has only this one shot or then go for this big cojones here. Maybe maybe I will save it. Save the replash then. So, so, yeah, let's just see what happens. Yeah, he sustains. God damn it. These are so annoying. Might as well kill some of these guys. I don't know where they will be going. We take from the elder stock. That guy is probably not in striking range. Actually, I think we will be fine, so I might as well overwatch for this guy, maybe? And then just take this shot. Oh, for a lucky hit. Yeah. No luck whatsoever. Still up. So you have learned at least one tactic. And this is happening all the time. This is so annoying. Oh, fucking mind control. Of course it works. So now we have to mox with Overwatch. Oh man, that was actually so smart of them. Taking out uh, Mox's oh what's like that. Oh he's chasing zombies, huh? This is not good. We lost uh, two guys to mind controls. And these are coming to us. They, they don't give us jack shit about the lost. Or I mean the admin. Except these few zombies. Oh, break the cover, please. You should be thanking the elders for their accord with the remains of your pathetic civilization. One thing I don't actually. Yeah, I cannot actually remove the mind controls. Fuck me. Oh, this is so bad. 
Yeah, that guy with the priest uh, is not not a talk. Can't uh, can't even slash him. The priests are so. Oh man, I don't know what I do with my guys. I'm not gonna attack them. That's it. <laughs> That's for sure. Uh, can rend him. I can rend him. Won't be even close. Close of killing him though. Hmm. Kind of lost all of grenades with these. Uh, these guys getting mind controlled. have the frostbite. Oh, I cannot, cannot get him with the frostbite. Mox is gonna be such a huge problem. He has so much damage and so much skills. I don't... Oh god, he might just kill, kill our guys. I think I can slash this guy as well. So with slash and rent, I might be able to do just enough to kill this guy. That way, I would actually get mayo back. I could then probably frost bomb Mox. Oh no! Wait, this guy's mind controlling Mox. Oh, so I would get Mox back, but I would uh, shit. I won't get mayo. And it's a huge if I would need uh, this last to actually hit. I do have a grenade with him. How much damage does this do? 4 to 5. This goddamn zombie horde as well. It's certainly going to be a problem. I need to take care of this guy as well. Uh, but if I kill this guy, I get mocks back. So that's kind of that has to be good enough for me. So I need to. I could take some shotgun shots first. Maybe try to kill this guy. If I miss, it's gonna be very very bad. But. Uh, It's 99 percent. Ah, you see that? Okay. You're gonna need to reload soon. Hmm. It means also this guy will get to hit somebody. But I mean, I just can't uh, block everyone here, can I? No, I. Oh, no! Don't slash that freaking zombie. Can I actually take out the zombie though? If I get Mox back, this position wouldn't be that bad. You are actually terrible dealing with the zombies with the podcaster. I should have, I should have thought about that because uh, there's no reason to bring the podcaster against zombies. But yeah, there could have been a ruler here, so I guess. Yeah, I guess there's no reason to not take this shot. Actually, killed quite a few zombies. Think I think this guy is going after this uh, this uh, guy, so I don't want to kill him. Rest rest of these, I don't know. I guess we will find out who they want to kill. So it's slashing time. I need to. I need hit. A sword is an unusual choice for creatures so lacking in physical prowess. <laughs> I 
Ah, that's not enough. That's that's not even close close of being enough. I need the sniper shot then, huh? The thing is the sniper will need to reload if I take out all these zombies. It's 94% shot on that guy, but I need the sniper to actually take take out the take out this guy. If, if the sniper doesn't take him out, there's no no taking him out. I guess I won't kill any of the zombies then. This might not be in range of anyone. Although I actually think they are. Maybe I should uh, take the weak ones here. It's a 100% shot. Uh, yeah. Although I will get Mox back. Yeah, he might be able to eliminate some of, some of these guys. They have so much hit points. Can we take the 75% shot? Come on! No sustain! No, oh, he got sustain. Oh, but the man card is still lost. Phew. Okay, I think I will actually rent this guy then. Mayo is Mayo is gonna be tricky. He might actually grenade my dudes up here. That's what I would do if I was in his shoes. So many, so many guys here. I guess the holo targeting effect doesn't play, but the holo targeting is still there because he was certainly holo targeted. Yeah. I don't know what happened with that. Yeah, I mean, uh, I mean the. Grenade from Mayo is more than likely if I keep my both both of my guys here, so maybe I maybe I will move up here a little bit. Start working on the zombies or what else can I even do? I have this this shot. Guess I can can reload now to see if there's shot or they're not gonna be that great, yeah. 44% shot on this guy. Definitely not gonna go for the zombies with this weapon though. Do I just take the 44%? If I break his cover... Can actually do a lot of damage. Then I just go poke, poke this guy. I hope he doesn't sustain again. That would be very, very annoying. Suffer my rage. <laughs> Yeah, maybe. Mm. What's the next action though? Mayo, please miss your so terrible soldier. Childish attempts at conjuring the elders' power will only bring further shame and 
suffering to your people. Templar. Just shut up. Shut up, dude. Nice shot. How dare you strike the elders' greatest champion? I can see no end to the suffering you will endure in retribution. You were born a lowly servant of the elders, and yet you managed to reach an even more wretched condition. I will end your suffering, traitor. The light has left him. Need ammo. Must reload now. Oh man, this is not good. Time and space to serve the elders. I don't think I really care about the object here anymore. Okay, Stasis is not the worst thing he could have done. I mean, just taking a normal flanking shot would be pretty bad. Mayo, please, miss. Actually, you're gonna hit that because you don't get the free action. Never mind. These wretched beings are perhaps even more pathetic now than they were before this pestilence afflicted them. Okay, Mayo might actually get some action here from the zombies. I don't know if the Warlock actually has weapon to deal with the zombies. My power precedes me wherever I go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, uh, balls. I need reloads. Uh, might as well take it. I think I can uh, kill this bolt then. Enemy down. I can severely wound this one. Or I could grapple away, but uh, it doesn't strike me as a good option. Uh, I think I will go and rent this guy. Still can't uh, rent, uh, rent the ba bad, bad guy, I mean the main guy. How about a uh, Reaper? Could I kill both of these? With that extra focus I get from killing one of these, I might be able to. The Reaper reduces damage each time I strike. And uh, I think the focus level gives me additional one damage, so I don't think I can actually kill this boat. I could take out two and then I move away. Maybe that's the best thing. Uh, I don't think the Reaper... Where it could be useful later on. Maybe I should uh, try to save it. This guy has uh, seven hit points. Yep, I can take him out. Their journey ends here. This guy has a little bit more. Their service is over. This guy has uh, seven hit points. I was actually thinking I should probably grapple the sniper here. Yeah, but that uh, I need a reload, Natalia Super, okay. Okay. I am the victor. I am almost out of ammunition. Taking care of these zombies is actually pretty important, so.
I think Mayo will get uh, struck no matter what I do, though. Yeah, this is pretty unlikely shot. I should still have the action after this thing. One hit point, huh? You had to live in with, with one hit point. The zombies might get this uh, this guy, but I think he will do his action first. So I don't think I want to leave it to the zombies, maybe. Maybe I do. Because I could just pistol this guy then. Actually, just rend him. Why not? Mm, there's so many zombies. Mm, I'm just gonna start with this priest. Actually, I should, uh, I'm just gonna read her. How much does the vault do? Oh, it does a lot of as well. What? Why does so much? Here. Maybe it was better against psionic units. Could actually jump. But I have I, I activated the Reaper already, so. It's very unlikely that I can kill that zombie, but this zombie should be guaranteed. They do actually give you focus. How about that? Yeah, we're still one damage short, so some things don't change. Uh, sure. You will pay the price. For every fallen child. Oh, elders, chosen information. I can still uh, rent this guy and run away, I believe. Or I could uh, bolt me or I'm not sure I want to do that. Just in case, I think I will do the set. Oh, come on. Why is that the only place I can rent him? It's not. Does a sweep blast that guy? <sighs> I don't think so. Hopefully Mayo can take a couple hits. Oh man, it's gonna be nasty. Oh, I still have a slider. Varlock might actually have to deal with those zombies. Just combat protocol that guy. Could also combat protocol the Varlock. But I think uh, killing this guy makes actually sense. He, that way he doesn't get to strike Mayo. Oh! Fuck. I got it, right? Was that a combat protocol? I guess it worked. So I shouldn't be too happy or mad. Luckily, it's the Codex doing the shooting, so he's not doing that much damage. These mind controls are absolutely insane. Do they even. even. Uh, have time limitation anymore? These insipid pests exist outside the realms of our conflict. Their ignorance serves them well here. My suffering no. increases! Where's the death, Are you ready to be redeemed? 
Okay, Mayo is back. So they do do run out. I think I will pistol this guy. Yep. No longer a threat. Then I think it's time uh, time for some grenade action here. Stop fooling around and uh, moving on target location. That will attract more lost, sir. But I think it's the only way we can get shots in if, at this guy. Come on. Oh, don't tell me this is not gonna work. Okay, I think this will work. So you don't like close range shots, was that the thing? I don't know if that's just a range thing or if that's a... Uh, if that means he doesn't... Uh, or if it means melee weapons, <laughs> is what I'm trying to say and failing constantly. Let's do this. But let's uh, find out I suppose. I think the shotgun does more damage. Hell yeah. Probably should have shredded him first. Oh, he doesn't have armor anymore. I think you're dead. I'm trying to count the hit points. It's very hard. They really need to include numbers in the base game. I shouldn't uh, need to have a mod for this. Or I should get the mod actually. But I wanna do a vanilla playthrough once then. But I think that's 8 hit points. My eyes are actually watering down because I'm trying to zoom in so hard. And it is even blinking which makes it so much harder. I think that's a guaranteed kill if I hit. So I might actually... Uh, I could take out that zombie for sure. And then try this shot. If it fails, I can. I can probably finish him off with the Templar. So. Target neutralized. Come on, Rolok. Die. No. Nope. A clever ploy, Commander. It was uh, just a strike, man. As much as of a, pl a ploy. Uh, sure. One hit point. Hell yeah! Welcome back, Mox. Hopefully. Okay, game. I will rededicate myself to the Elder's vision. I will treat this defeat as a sign. And I must elevate myself to a higher stratum. I'm sure we'll see them again, but that Chosen sure wasn't expecting the fight we put up today, Commander. Okay, so now we need to finish off the target. I hope it can survive one more turn, because I don't think we can... Uh, there's an open door right there, man. <laughs> we might actually trigger them by accident. I don't really want to. Plus there's one zombie there. If you say so. On Overwatch. Wow, that actually came so close of triggering them. I really don't uh, don't wanna do that, so maybe run back. Maybe I'll just overwatch this turn. Hope that the overwatch get that, get that zombie. And next turn we will, if the objective survives this one more turn. Oh shit. How about you? Did you not something? 
Damage though, so not the not the worst. <sighs> as much as I wanna trigger them, I kind of wanna deal with this guy as well. Oh, this is just guaranteed kill. Uh, but then I could kill zone these three guys. I mean, this is gonna be guaranteed kill. Out. So, I do have enough to get that other group. Uh, I kind of want to trigger them now before they run away, and I don't think I can. Uh, I can get uh, any kind of guaranteed. Yeah, but if I reload, I won't be able to go for them. Shit, this, this, this is bad. Maybe I will have to wait one more turn and hope that they don't actually kill the target. Although that feels pretty, pretty bad option. Okay, we'll get the sniper. Sniper here. I think I will just uh, reload the sniper then. We'll wait one more time. Good riddance. And if it happens that uh, that one turn was too much, I mean, Reloaded. not much I can do, but no trespassers. The swarm might actually appear as well. Ready to engage. But I mean, we need reloads and stuff. Moving to Overwatch. No one gets by them. me. Good to go. Come get some. Ready I feel like these types of missions are just so dangerous at this stage of the game. Got it covered. Just. Oh god. Okay. Let's see how many hit points that Let's thing has left. Already. Oh, it's a... <laughs> of course, that's why it didn't reveal us. There's a wall. There's a freaking wall. Idiot. Okay. Well. Maybe Mox can a start the plot then. Aid. Objective located. Oh, it's very low. It's very, very low. I mean, I'm, I guess that's not a surprise, really. I guess Mox has to go down if I'm gonna trigger those. I feel like I wanna trigger those. Do I wanna kill zone first though? So. I guess. I Let's see what happens. Ordered. I think the one move will run, you know. Wrong direction that we kill zones. Yeah. Oh, he's coming in. Nice. At least we hit all three shots this time. Oh, that's an interesting location. a nice time to be plus actually what do I actually need is a uh, quality question as well we'll go and rent this guy probably the safest bet I don't really want to rent uh, rent one of these mutants it might get a uh, well a little bit dangerous feel the power of the Templars He's down. Yeah. I should probably just find out. Find a find good cover. 
whatever reason you don't have shot against this guy. But you have on the guy. Guy all the way back there. Why? Oh, there's a hole in the wall. Okay, actually, that's good enough. How many is that now? And that sort of was really good enough. Okay. So we still have mayo. We can't do much. I think this mutant might actually leave, so I'm actually gonna be blast. And hope for the luck. Lucky hit at something. Actually, is the grenade a guaranteed kill? It's not. It's not. I think I have to combat for a go here. I could take the shot as well, but uh. Ooh, I could combat for a go him. Oh man. I'm thinking which one I consider to be more dangerous, the mutant or this guy, but I think the only way to kill both is uh, well with a lot of luck. I'm wondering if Mayo could get shot on the codex so, 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 somehow. I think these are all shots on the mutant. But I mean, uh, Mox can't do anything about the Codex either, so... Might as well take this shot. I could've given accent to my other guys. With Mox. Who is your teammate? That's uh, it's almost good enough, but not quite. Because he didn't have the vision. Let's finish this guy up. I'm gonna use the combat protocol so I don't need to reload. I then have uh, heals available. Give me heal. Let's do. Let's do this. Let's do combat protocol the codex. You just get the hell out of there. I think you can block the staircase so the mutant cannot actually come. And I'm actually thinking that my best bet with uh, Mayo here is uh, just uh, just overwatch him. Can I get the frost bomb? Orders confirmed. Moving out. Uh, the frost bomb might actually attract some. Guys, so let's just go watch. I'm fairly certain he will charge somebody. Oh, the kill zone is still active. I forgot totally about the kill zone. Well, it was a miss anyway. Oh, you bastard. Oh my god, that. That, that target cannot have a much HP. I can actually run from that hole as well. That's interesting. Yeah, let's just finish this. I think this might be it. Who's keeping score? Status confirmed. All oh. down and the okay, that was secure. That was actually very smooth. It was the longest mission I ever, but our propaganda effort is not funded from my research budget. Nope, and I certainly hope that your advent burgers aren't either. All but yeah. advent gene therapy clinics will be closed tomorrow for equipment upgrades. Initial reports that the suspension of services were the result of dissident activity have been dismissed as radical propaganda. Yeah, I felt like that was pretty solid. Pretty solid round there. 
you guys got hurt, but uh, nothing too bad, and I can still go for the assassin next. Time. This just goes to show that the chosen are vulnerable, and we can take them down. We just have to figure out how to keep them down. Demolition suppression. Neither of them. I guess the demolition with these weapons might actually be better. Let's uh, let's take that option. You didn't actually have a reflect. I feel like the deep focus is actually pretty solid. Yeah, out of these options, I think it's uh, it's the best. There are a few options like a pillar. I I've yet to try. I think this might be actually pretty nice. Just the ability to generate high cover. Wherever. Mm. And uh, these skills like the invert are actually pretty insane. This this might allow some crazy stuff. I have the deflect, so maybe I should take the reflect though. When the Templar has two or more focus, so yeah, I should make. Let's take deep focus. And not take anything else because he's out of points. Oh, super extended magazine or expanded and advanced. That's nice. Hello, Commander. My Mufradal, the engineer. Yeah, don't tell me more. I know. I know enough about our low scientist situation. Okay, that speeds up that nicely, and I can move uh, her uh, to the resistant contact next. So that should work out perfectly. But uh, that's a long enough episode for now, so see you guys on the next one. See you there. Bye.